Hello, tiny people living in my computer. I'm Finn. Hi, dear. Uh, and today I need to record something, but I'm bored, and I don't want to put together, like, one of my- because normally my videos are more thought out, and I decided I'd just sit and talk about stuff. Uh, so today I'm talking about artsy stuff, uh, and you can kind of see that. It's not- it's not very showy. It's like dry erase markers, so it's not gonna show up super well. But I just, I just, I don't know. I like it, did, so I did it. Pay no attention to the Sonic menu that I stole. I mean, borrowed. Uh, but it's art time, baby. Ooh. Um, I'm not good at this. I don't know how to draw. I don't know how to paint. None of that. Uh, I just started doing it one afternoon because I thought it would be cool. Uh, so, to start, we got this little eyeball gimmick. I'm gonna try to get it to show. If I get out of the frame, maybe it'll look better. Probably can't read it. Yeah, because it's gonna be mirrored. But I got a little eyeball guy, little eyeball dude. Uh, this little fella, tiny little guy, little dude, tiny little fella. Uh, and then, on this side, we have the maw. Into the maw. He hungers. Oh. He's a hungry boy. He is a hungry little guy. And now I have a little notebook that's got some drawings in it, so we'll, we'll, we'll hop into that. This is Flam. She's my daughter, and I love her. She ain't got no arms. She's got lore. There's lore, because I love lore. She's got lore. Uh, Flam likes shoes, legs, uh, the dark trash pile, it's, it's like her house. Uh, soft voices and fonts. Uh, the fonts thing is because of me. I'm autistic. I like fonts. Uh, Flam dislikes people, animals, and cheese. But yeah, this little Flam, look at it. Look at that girl. Look at her. Look at this little, look at this little lady. Her such a sad little blushy critter. Uh, this is her best friend, Paul. Trying to get it to, you, you can kind of tell. He's, he's got a little bit of a big head, but it's okay. We love Paul and his big head. Uh, Paul has some lore. Uh, Paul likes hot dogs, lasers, cars, and friends. Paul dislikes milk, loud noises, flying, and attitudes. Familiar face. It's the Maw 2.0. He's, he's 50 feet tall. He's real tall. He's got two feet and his little tongue in there. He's like got all this stuff on him. I like him. I think he's goofy. I like his tiny little dumb eyes. Uh, this is the one I'm probably most proud of. Uh, this is Pablo Pinelli Pandini. Uh, he's the world's shittiest circus clown. But yeah, I like him. I enjoy Pablo. He's pro he's the one I'm most proud of. I want to make it... My camera's not very good quality. But yeah, that's Pablo. He's cool. I like him. Uh, he's a really... His lore is basically that he's really tall. Really lanky. Uh, he says, oh baby, a lot. He, he's got like a Bostonian accent. Uh, he's not funny at all. Uh, and he, he loves, like, the 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 characters uh i have him i wrote it down as loves the kids but that doesn't that doesn't sound good uh he's friendly he's a good feller pablo is a good boy man good man woman pablo's a good person he's guy he's guy what can i say he's guy i don't think guy has lore yeah he's just guy <laughs> Uh, this is Theo. Uh, I'll, I'll let it linger a little bit longer. This is Theo. Uh, she is not a thumb. Do not call her a thumb. That's so rude. Literally, Mom. And then, uh, here, I can go back. 
also Flam has a bully, and the bully's name is Seraph, which is ironic because uh, uh, Flam 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 Flam. Flam really likes fonts, and her bully is named after a fawn. A, f a, f a fond. God, I hate. Also, tiny note about Seraph. She has, like, a bully-type crush on Paul. Which is weird. But... It's fine. Next up, we got Marcus the Mustache. He's Hispanic. He's a womanizer, and he really likes plants. That, that's about it for him. He doesn't have much else. He's, he's just he's a mustache and not a cool guy. But he likes plants. So shout out to, shout out to plants. This is David. Uh, David thinks that he is him. David is not him. He has Heelys. He's got Heelys on. And his weird little unitard. But yeah, this is David. He thinks he's him. He's not him. Lil Bro is not him. Bro thinks he's the... Bro, th bro thinks he's... Yeah, you get it. You guys have brains. Now, I have to repeat, I don't know how to draw. So, the the next two, I tried really hard, they aren't good. So, don't be mean. Uh, I drew, I drew Mysterio. I really like Mysterio. He's my, he's like, he's definitely top five Spider-Man villains for me. He's not number one. Number one is Goblin. Number two is probably Shocker, but I really like Mysterio. He's probably five, because uh, I think four is Lizard. But I, I love this guy, and his his design's kind of simple. He's just got kind of got a fishbowl and a cape, so I just kind of winged it, and I, I think I did okay. I I don't like how that looks, like the. I don't know how to describe it. I don't like how the little shoulder bits look. I feel like it doesn't look natural, but I do think I did well, on on like this part of his, of his cape, like the part in front of the bowl. I think I did good here with like how it overlaps. Down on the like bits of the cape, I don't think I did great, but I, I tried. And then a lot of times his little pendants right here, they have like the eyeball, like, like they have the shape and the circle, but they don't have anything inside of it. So I gave it a little dot just to make it mine. I like him. I was gonna like try to draw like smoky effects, but I don't know how. Also, I don't think it's super visual, visible, visible bubble, but if you look closely, uh, like there, I tried to give him a little bit of definition for like muscle, but I don't know how to fuck to draw. I don't know how to fuck a, I don't know how to fuck a draw. So the last uh, drawing I have is one I did the other day of Spooderman. Uh, regular regular red webbed suit but I didn't I didn't color it because I I don't really know how to do that without it looking like dog ass I might go and color it half I might go and color it later uh, but currently I don't I don't know um, and then symbio suit I give it a little bit of I don't know how to shade but I added a little bit of something I don't like this I don't like this at all I didn't know what to do so I I don't like it but I think I did okay on this. The proportions are a little weird and the eyes aren't equal, like they don't match. But I like it. I think it I think it's better than Mysterio. But uh it's it's alright. I like it. Spooderman, I love him. He's my favorite. I made a video about him, and if you haven't seen it, go watch it. Put these up. <laughs> And I've got more. It's time for paintings. This one's the only big one I've done. Uh, I kind of just did it. Uh, and it took me a very long time to, to actually, like, make. Uh, not because it's crazy or super complex, but because I kept losing what I wanted to do. Because at first I was going to do another landscape. And then I didn't want to because I felt like that was repetitive. So then I just tried to do some weird color stuff with the black and the orange. And then afterwards, I, it just sat, uh, after I finished the orange, it sat for two months before I touched it again. And that's where the white came from. Um, and I didn't know what to do, so I just kind of messed with stuff. Um, and I like this one a lot, because it looks a lot like a feather. But 
they're kind of just random scribbles. They don't have much meaning, but it's a fun texture. I really like this one. Uh, I'm not, it's not my favorite one that I've done, but I like it. Now is for, now it's time for the ones that I don't like. All right, the ones I'm not very proud of. I don't like this one. I don't like it. I don't like this one. I like the background. I kinda, I, I dig the, the trees. I don't know what they are. I guess they're trees. I made it, I can say what they are. Uh, but the yellow, I tried to like give like an accent of like lighting and it just didn't work. The brush is too thick. I was pushing too hard, something it didn't work. And then this like pond or lake or whatever, it didn't turn out well. So I'm not a big fan of this one. But I, I, it's not my least favorite. I don't hate this one. I just don't like it. This one, on the other hand, I really don't like. Um, it was my first try at like actually painting something instead of just throwing colors. Uh, and I don't like it. I like the colors. I like this orange. This yellow is nice. And that pink's nice. Uh, but I don't like this. And also the little cacti barely look like cacti. They just look like green stubs. Uh, so I'm not... Not the biggest fan of this one. This doesn't make me happy. This is my least favorite one I've done. This one I actually really like. There's not a whole lot behind it. I just kind of liked pink. I just I did a black background because I like using black as my like base color. Um, and then I just kind of I decided I liked pink and I put pink on it. And I was like, what what's something that usually doesn't go with pink? And then I came up with doing like a, a baby vomit green, and I like it. I think it works in like all directions too, because like this makes it look like a like a really feminine like like a makeup job sorta. You know what I'm saying? Like it's like an eye and appears where like the what's it? Fuck, I'm bad at names for makeup stuff. I don't know if you guys could tell, but I have, I don't have any on right now. I know I'm beautiful, but I don't have any. But like that's fun, and then like when it's set like straight up both ways it kind of looks like a like a void or like a portal or something it's cool and then if it's if it's set like this i don't know what it looks like but it's something uh but i i like this one this one is good and then funnily enough the first one i ever did is my favorite one i did um uh i have it labeled as just return is what i called it uh i got the idea because I was watching uh, WWE Survivor Series last year and Sam Punk came back and I was like, oh cool, everybody's talking about hell freezing over and then I was like, oh that's a cool idea and then I was like, fuck it, I want to start painting and I was like, okay so I, all the red and stuff is for hell and the blue is for the freezing over but I really like it and I like all this, like the how rough that texture is and like how they, they like bleed over a lot there's like two spots where the blue touches the red, one down here and one up here that just kind of caps it to where like the, this is the end of the visual, but like throughout here none of them touch, but there are a bunch of like almost touching, like through here there's a bunch that almost, it's so nice, I like this. I also, I like looking at it both ways, I don't like it sideways, sideways I'm not a fan. I'm a fan of that, that, and that. I don't like this. This looks stinky. That's okay. I like this. That's my favorite. I like this. This is fun. I like this. <laughs> and I guess I should show that off a little bit better if I can. I don't know, because the light back there and stuff is in the way. I don't know if I can do it very good. But it's nice. Maybe I can. Yeah. But then it's dark. You can sort of see. It's down here is green, that's blue, then it's green and red, and up there is red. I like it. I think it's fine. I like. My wife, yes. My wife, yes. But uh, yeah, that's me showing off art stuff for like 10 minutes or whatever. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.